Hello, folks. Um, give me a second while I bother people, as usual. Um, I ended up missing the stream, uh, or I, I had intended to stream last night, but I ended up not doing it because, um, migraines and shit. Uh, so that sucked. Uh, I'm feeling a bit better now, but I'm still a little woozy. I took some migraine stuff, and it always knocks me the fuck out. <clears throat> Let's see, so last time we we got in our uh, intellectual debate with the dragon, of course, we, we uh, battled our, our dogmas, yada yada yada, we killed the dragon, um, which is what happens when you win a debate against the dragon, of course, and then uh, everything got fucked up, and we spent some time in the overfall. I think that's pretty much it. Um, in between sessions, I did a little more farming in the Everfall. Um, I, I really just fought the Hydra and Dragon again, and um, was able to get up to the 20 Weight Stones, so I'm done with the Everfall, basically. <clears throat> um, until, like, I'm ready to finish the playthrough, basically. Um, I would originally had wanted to do Bitter Black Isle tonight, but I think what I'm going to do instead is do a tour of the changes that have happened. Because um, everything's kind of fucked up now, and there's a lot of extra bosses, and um, we can fight like half a dozen dragons. So that's going to be the goal for tonight, is to just fight all the dragons. Hey, Light. How was uh, the bracket tonight? <clears throat> Anyway, um, I, I have a question of, to the game really quick. So there's three of us that live here, right? Is this bed large enough? I feel like we should have, like, a queen or something at least. Lord. Yeah, there's going to be a lot of dragons once uh, we get going here. So I think... Uh, Hip alluded to this the other night, but most of the changes are on the road between here and Grand Soren. So we're gonna go on a road trip to Grand Soren, <clears throat> and I'll try and point out uh, everything that's fucked up now. I also like changed my costume around a bit, and I got some new pawns. Oh yeah, I switched out um, the daggers I'm using. These are... They do frost damage. Which I think will make the... Um, Let yourself on fire tech do more damage. Anyway, so now there's... Uh, this new classic goblin up here. are so tiny. Like, you'd expect the endgame versions of, like, one of the default enemies to, like, be bigger or something, but... Oh yeah, that's right, you mentioned that there was that, um... Uh, what's their name? Who's, like, very good. Ended up getting paired up against you. 
Uh, there's also a... It's not a Chimera, it's a Gore Chimera. We fought one of these in the uh, temple on the way over to the dragon before. Yeah, the delay seems like a lot bigger than usual. Man, you really get put to sleep for a really long time in this game, huh? There we go. Yeah, it seems like the delay is like a minute or two, maybe at least. We did it. Oh god, the quest just gave me something. What did it foist on me? God damn it. I mean, it's an animal weapon, so that's kind of good, I guess. I'll take that. Probably actually pick that stuff up. You can see monsters for leagues on the open shore. Give this to Kanon, I guess, and then any time. Let's have a look at that rise in the land. There may be hard to harvest. The lay of the land defies. This tree is fine, I guess that's all that matters, but it is kind of frustrating. Oh, there's something I should show up in here really quick. Uh, so there's this dude. He's been here for a while. He sells stuff that you can buy with uh, Rift Crystals. Which are like the alternate currency that we've been collecting a whole bunch of over the course of this uh, playthrough. So over here we have all these uh, elixirs. So every pawn has their own... They're called like inclinations and they uh, control like how the pawn behaves. And you can use these to um, change which inclinations uh, are most represented in them and stuff like that. So that's very useful. Um, this is some kind of character customization stuff. Um, so this is, uh, down here we have the art of metamorphosis, um, art of metamorphosis and the secret of metamorphosis. Um, secret of metamorphosis you can only get after the game finishes. Both of them let you um, change your, like, <clears throat> they'll let you go back into character creation basically from the title screen. Secret of Metamorphosis lets you do it whenever you want. Um, Art of Metamorphosis only lets you do it once, and then you gotta buy it again. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and grab that. Um, there's also various weapons. He sells eyeglasses, which don't really do a whole lot of everything. Anything. 
Um, you saw these gloves which are neat. <laughs> yes, it's, it's, uh, you can get trans or gender. Well, it's not really juice, but the, the metamorphosis thing does let you do that. Choose as you will, sir. I'm but yeah, so there's some cool stuff there. I mentioned it a couple of times, but the fire uh, buff I got going on here actually does blunt damage for some reason, which means that it'll still do like okay damage against uh, dogs and stuff for these hellhounds. Oh, you're having a little trouble there, huh, buddy? This fucking dog is backdashing like crazy. <laughs> <laughs> 